Hi, I'm Teresa. Today I'm going to teach you how to make buku pandan. To make buku pandan, we need, first of all, we need a bag of this shredded young coconut Cymex. Kinai na buku by Cymex International. You can find this at the freezer section of your supermarket. We need the young coconut one. Make sure that you've got the young coconut. And then we need a bag of that. That's about 16 ounces. And we need two bars of agar agar. Agar agar, this is a natural gelatin and it's green color so you don't, we don't have to put um, food coloring. We need pandan and since we don't have pandan in our area, I bought this frozen pandan leaves and this, you can see they're cut into tiny pieces like this. They've been divided into tiny pieces so we need four like this and we need um, Four, four cups of water, put this in the pan. We need four cups of water to dissolve our gulaman and this is a um, half a cup of sugar. We'll let this boil and then we put the four pandan leaves with this day of our flavor. This is our flavor. If you don't have pandan leaves, you can use pandan essence. That's pandan leaves. If you don't have pandan leaves in this area, you can use this one, pandan flavor. You can put one tablespoon. Now I want our buku pandan to taste nice, so I'm using this. This is our gulaman, gulaman bars. I got this from the supermarket. It's called Party Choice. Party Choice brand Gulam and Green. It comes in a set of four and it comes in the green color. So I'm using this. We'll just wait for this to boil. We're waiting for the sugar to dissolve and for the pandan leaves to be thoroughly cooked. So it will bring out this nice taste to the gulaman, the gelatin. We're waiting for the pandan to be completely cooked. When this turns brown, when the leaves turn brown, then it's ready. We're just waiting for it to turn. Now that this changed color, I'm gonna take this away and put the gulaman in. So this is ready. And now I'm gonna break this gulaman into pieces. Put this here. Mix this. And now that it's completely dissolved, I need a bowl and a sieve to put this in. I'm trying to stain all this solid, solid gulaman bar. I'm trying to strain this. A little bit hot. I'm straining this. There's still a, there's always some bits that's gonna be left. So I get to strain this to make it finer. And then we can throw away the rest of this.
we can throw this away and this we let it cool down for a while here on the countertop and then we can refrigerate this for half an hour it uh, hardens so quickly this natural gulaman hardens so quickly I left this gulaman in the fridge to cool now that it's cool I left this for about an hour now that it's cool I'm going to invert this on this plate and cut it into cubes Now we can cut this into tiny cubes, like this. Now I'm ready to make the coconut mixture for our buku pandan. This is the gelatin, we've done the gelatin, we've cubed them. We just have to put this at the back. Now we're ready to make our coconut mixture. To make the coconut mixture, I'm using this organic heavy whipping cream. You can find this at the U.S. supermarket. This is so delicious. And I need coconut milk. I have this ready-made coconut milk from the Asian grocery store. And we need um, white sugar. We need one cup of heavy whipping organic cream. Put it there. This is one cup. This is for our coconut mixture. And then half a cup of coconut milk there mix them together and just a quarter cup of sugar mix them together this is our coconut mixture for the buku panda and it's so easy to make and then And then last but not the least, this is the frozen young coconut. This is the buco. It's 16 ounces, it's one packet. This has been frozen, so I put it in the fridge to cool this. This heavy week print cream is um, this was refrigerated, so when this is all ready to serve, they're all being in the fridge. The coconut milk's been in the fridge. All of this, this I throw this in the refrigerator. So it's ready to serve. This is the young coconut, frozen young coconut. It's called Samex brand. I'm using Samex brand young coconut. This is a whole packet. 16 ounces. Put them there together. Now, there are two ways of serving. There are two ways of serving our buku pandan. What you can do is, um, if you want to serve them individually, we can use these ice cream cups. We can layer them. What we do is we can layer them together. Go one layer. One layer with gelatin. And then put the buco mixture on top. So you'll have a nice presentation. Okay, enough to cover it. Like that. And then can have another layer so it will have a nice presentation you can see the color this is another way of serving or you can mix them all together but I prefer doing it like this this will make a nice presentation you can either mix them all together in a clear bowl like this or service individual.